Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and we're going to be doing another anime first impressions. Now, this one, Akiba's Trip, and um, for a while I was wondering what the name really was. Was it Akiba's Trip or Akiba's Trip? And um, what I've learned, at least I think I'm right, is that it's called Akiba's trip so you have these uh first you have this guy character who you learned uh likes anime likes manga he is in the district in japan that is really popular then this girl shows up with a bat and she starts destroying people um who are possessed by these other creatures so what happens is that the way they defeat them is they undress them. So, it, not completely, obviously, but at a point where so much skin shows, the sun destroys them. That kind of, from the beginning, I was like, okay, this is another fan service anime. So, I, I keep a trip, the animation, to be precisely correct is based on games that came out a few years ago and a lot of people liked them and obviously I know now why they did. So personally I don't like fan service stuff so when I watch this I watched the first three episodes to do my first impression video and episode by episode I was like oh man oh gosh oh oh it the story is very fan service based. Um, there is some type of action adventure part to it, uh, which is also considered adventure action anime. Um, those scenes I appreciated; they were good until the end part where they have to destroy them by getting them undressed. So I don't really, I didn't like this. My first impression rating for this anime, it's gonna be a low. 2.5 out of 10, and this is why. Um, I do understand that fan service is obviously what people sometimes want from anime, but this one has a lot of it, and it's just too much. The other thing to it is I've seen some fan service based animes, and they actually have good stories. Um, so sometimes it's worth watching it as long as it has a good story. This one, so far, has no good story, has nothing different from other animes that don't have fan service stuff in it, and this one did, it's very etchy, it's very fan service based, and I didn't like it, and it has nothing different than others that don't have this, so why would I want to spend my time in watching this? So, my first impressions, like I said, rating is a 2.5 on this, it's very low, and uh, I, I would have would have given it lower other than the few scenes that I enjoyed that had some action in it. So that, that's what I think so far. It's not good. I probably won't do an anime review on this because I probably won't watch the entire season. So what do you guys think? Do you guys agree with me? Do you think I'm being too cruel <laughs> to this anime? Leave a comment below. Give me a like. Uh, subscribe to my channel for more anime. Um reviews and more manga reviews and more comic reviews i'm trying to be very broad with my stuff but there's a limit to what i like and i don't like and um, obviously this is reviews are all based on my opinion so and if you're watching this far might as well subscribe to my channel and uh subscribe there on the button below thank you so much if you have already and thank you for the support that you give me and like always don't be strangers